Hey everybody, what's up? It's DJ Jerry here with Shop Time. If you remember last year, I don't know if you remember this video or not, we did this huge outdoor event uh, called Pro-Am Jam. It's a big golf tournament for pro and amateurs. And for one of their night events, kind of the, uh, the Friday night party, they do a late night shootout, golf shootout. And last year we did some moving heads over on the greens. We did a nice cool wash that just basically uh, scanned across the greens. And then actually, when the ball was hit and it landed on the green, we would actually use our moving heads and we used Show Express. We mapped out the entire green. Wherever the ball would land, I could push a button and all the moving heads would point to where the ball landed. So that was a cool thing we did last year. This year, the sponsors wanted to up it a little bit. They wanted to make it even better and bigger bigger and better. So this year uh, what they're going to do is we're actually going to install some things into the water to create some cool effects. Now last year again this is you know no one really knew about it and they were all you know a couple drinks in and a lot of them were hitting it into the water. Well this year when they hit it into the water they're going to have a little explosion that's going to happen. We've got these air cannons that we had or that we have. Um, they're actually going to be submerged into the water and we have a wireless, wireless remote, so as soon as someone hits it in the water, we're going to surprise them with a big blast of water. Um, it goes about 30 feet in the air, so it should be a really cool effect. And uh, I'll get you all the information on these. Um, we started doing a dry run on them. We haven't actually done, we haven't put them in the water yet. We're going to show you everything on how these work, how they function, what exactly they do, and how you could probably use them in one of your style of events or your productions. Probably not for a wedding. Um, but again, it, there's a lot of different things out there uh, where you you might need something like this or you might want something like this. Maybe put it in your own home pool. Who knows? But uh, we're going to keep you posted. We're going to walk you through exactly how we're going to do the install and how all this is going. So one of the things we're doing with our air cannons, just because this is basically five pounds of complete openness uh, air, basically. And we want to make sure that it doesn't float because there's going to be a lot of buoyancy there. So we strapped it to a pallet and we're actually gonna get big boulders to put on top of this pallet. Uh, it'll allow us to get it up out of the, out of the water a lot easier too. So uh, the, the, basically what happens here is there is a check valve or there's a valve that connects into this hose that allows the, the air pressure to go into and fill the tank. Once the tank's filled, there's a diaphragm in here that pushes up, locks it in, or locks it in the tank and then once the air pressure is actually released from this point all the air in the tank will actually explode through this cannon right here so kind of a neat little thing uh, or a neat little system it's got really cool results so we're gonna keep uh, keep moving here and we'll show you how we get it in we have our fountains installed they're installed into the pond we kind of showed a little bit about that we strapped them to the pallets and then we add some boulders we put boulders on top of the pallets to hold them down again just because there's so much air pressure in those tanks and it's going to make them float one of the things we had to add because this is a night event we had to make sure that we could illuminate it we could we could light things up so we have these strips here as you can see um, these are the chauvet ip fixtures these are the uh, color picks IP, uh, great fixtures. And the reason we, we are using these is because they are waterproof. So when the explosion happens, if it gets on these lights, we don't have to worry about any of the, uh, the problems of uh, obviously short circuit and things like that. Now they're an RGB fixture and you can actually pixel map all these, which is a really cool effect. We've done that with a couple different events. Uh, and it's always turned out really great. They're super bright and <clears throat> they're also power linkable. They're DMX linkable and the connections that they have are actually a waterproof connection. So it gives you a nice tight seal uh, and not you don't have to worry about uh, obviously any moisture or anything. So the reason we added these is because otherwise uh, the explosion would happen and you wouldn't be able to see it. So I'll show you what it looks like. We have a wireless remote, which you can't see right now, but the wireless remote, when we press this wireless remote, got an explosion so again a really cool effect what they're gonna be doing is when they're teeing off they'll be teeing off probably right around this area and they'll be shooting and this will all be illuminated all be uh, moving heads over on the greens over there but just these four lights you can see that we have these uh, Chauvet DJ IP fixtures they're shooting across and it's about oh, pretty close to 100 yards and you can actually see those trees over there 
actually getting illuminated just from those fixtures right there. So again, it tells you how bright they are. But when I activate the remote, we'll show you one more time, this is what they'll see. If they hit it in the water, water cannons will go off. So these turned out really cool. We're pretty excited and I know our client's gonna be thrilled when we get these babies fired off. So if you have any questions, feel free to contact me. You can reach me at jeremy at djjrshoptime.com. Again, it's jeremy at djjrshoptime.com. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.